Oh well, no, I just managed to land in Kiev. I slept only two hours, a little bit exhausted, a little bit tired, but still motivated. Now, this is the airport, right? And uh, would you like to know how you can tell this is the airport? <laughs> By checking this out, as you can see, this is a plane, and this is what I call good recycling. You know, instead of destroying all this, just painted bright colors, review to the airport. I think it's an excellent marker for people to know that this is the airport. Oh yeah. Also the sign says Kiev. I know you may not know the alphabet, but yeah, this is Kiev. So yeah, I'm in Kiev. Time to explore. I just landed. I haven't even checked in yet, as you can see, I have my suitcase with myself. But check the navigation and apparently near to the airport there's an aviation museum which I will show you right now. As you can see we got planes and if I'm not mistaken these are gonna be all uh, Soviet airplanes. So I'm gonna come see, do some filming and hopefully I'm gonna see some old Russian planes. I mean Soviet planes. Why do I keep saying Russian? It's Soviet made. And that's it. Anyway, continuing. <laughs> Alright, so I have to admit there's a lot of impressive planes here, but one particularly caught my attention and uh, it's this one, so as you can see. Now, I can, it probably can't read, but this is Aeroflot, and as you can see as SSR and of course the Soviet Union flag. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab my briefcase and I'm gonna go underneath it so you can get a better look. Oh boy. This thing is huge. I'm not joking, honestly. Look at the size of these tires. Jesus. So, yeah. Oh. And even underneath the wings, it says SSR. <laughs> oh, labeling everywhere, even though they're not labeling a product. But a government, a way of governing. Alright, I just found an actual plane where you can actually board, look inside. So luckily, I have my suitcase with me, I guess time to board Aeroford Airlines. With the big communist flag. So yeah, let's board and see what's inside. Oh, oh could you believe irony? Apparently you needed another ticket to go there and I didn't have a ticket so I couldn't board the plane. <laughs> Here's another local attraction, considering the museum is near an airport. All the people looking at planes actually landing and coming back, as you can see. I know, it's funny when you think about it. I think this is a lot more interesting than that, but, you know, if the people think that's more interesting, who am I to judge? But Jesus Christ, look at the size of that one. That's huge! 
That's humongous. Yeah, honestly, there is a lot to, to see in here. So I'd rather to stick to the old planes than to the uh, what's behind me. 